And welcome to Lisbon, the Portuguese capital. We're here at the home of Sporting. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. And gearing up for this pulsating Liga Portugal match, it's Sporting facing Braga. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Here's the lineup for Sporting. Well, they're playing with a 5-2-3, as we can see it here. But somebody has to step in to join those two midfield players. It could be one of the fullbacks or it could be one of the centre halves. So keep an eye out for that. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in, and two forwards who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. And this confrontation is underway. Paulinho. And the ball with Pedro Gonzalves. And now Paulinho. Determined defending. Oh, a big mistake. And I think we can call him one mighty relieved goalkeeper. Well, he can smile now, but that was a big blunder. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to break... Oh, they could be in here, Stuart! Corner kick forthcoming. Trying to deliver it accurately. A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, there we have it. The first yellow card of the game. And he's going to have to be careful now. There's a long time to go here. And they need to get tighter here. It's a perfect challenge.
Bodies forward and the break looks on. Defenders need to cover. And just like that, the counter-attack comes to an end. And top-notch as well as brave goalkeeping. Well, he comes off his line at just the right time. He read that brilliantly. Pedro Gonzalves. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Busrati. Yuri Medeiros. Ricardo Orta. A creative look about this. Will they get themselves level here? Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Able to close down the shot. A very effective clearance. Who can he pick out? Takes it on! And the keeper more than equal to the task. played into the box and he did what he had to do defensively well lovely work to get past his man can he put it away a goal real excitement a back and forth type of game now they're level well here's the replay and it's a really good bit of play Watch how he turns his marker and then has the composure to finish. That's a top-class goal. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser, 1-1. Andre Orta. Good looking sequence. We finish! Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Could be a chance to break here. Well, it petered out. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. He got in the way of that cross. That is that for the first half here. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, he certainly got his team back into this game with that goal. Because up to that point, they hadn't played particularly well. I think he's had a decent first half, but he'll be looking to build on his goal in the second 45. So back underway here, into the second half. advantage with them referee says play on chance to cross this looks promising still on level terms moving the ball nicely well they were very patient but they no longer have the ball counter attacking very much an option
Threading it forward. And a goal it is to put them in front again. No less than they deserve. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. Ali Musrati, Abel Rui. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. But then the commentator's curse comes into play. Breaking at pace. Oh, no stopping him. Oh, a lovely ball. And a goal! Calls for celebrations again. Two in front. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So on with the action, and 3-1 the scoreline at the moment. Well, the visitors, as you can see, have enjoyed so much of the possession, but they've shown a real lack of creativity today. They need to be far more inventive in the final third if they're to turn things around here. 20 minutes remaining. And slipped through beautifully. It's a neat move. And the snuffing out of the cross there. Andre Orta. Ricardo Orta. Not high quality defending. Paulinho. This attack looks highly promising. And disappointing for the players of the centre that it didn't reach them. Abel Rui. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Spot on with that tackle. Can they hit on the break? Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Well, the keeper asking too much of his teammates on this occasion. Throw in to come. And space to cross it. Vital interception. The danger was very real. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. He's going forward well here. And it's gone behind for the corner.
Can he deliver it with accuracy? Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out any sign of danger. The referee blows for full time, it ends in a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals, and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. His performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Willie did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.